This is Cherry. I'm 21 years old. You must be wondering why I'm wearing this mask. Why I'm hiding myself? What makes me scared to reveal my identity? Who I'm scared of? When will this mask drop off? Well, before I answer your questions, I want to tell you something about myself. This is something very important. Being a guy, I'm attracted towards another guy, both emotionally and physically. I thought to myself that this is a passing phase of my life, and once I get married, things will be fine. Also, I never saw any gay in my surrounding and family and relatives. There was no one. I tried best to hide my feelings. Whenever the feeling of same-sex love came up, I felt guilty. Sometimes I cried alone and thought of repentance. Also, gay was being referred as an abuse. This abuse was my identity that I had to live with forever. What could be more distressing, listening all your life that you are a hijra because being gay is thought to being a hijra. I felt depressed. There was no one to talk to. Moreover, being Christian and a believer, I just can't be that kind of a guy. Genesis 1 verse 27 So God created man in his own image. I was so motivated with this verse that God the Almighty has created me in his own image. Accepting yourself is being open and honest with yourself. Self-acceptance may not be easy, but it is possible. And now I'm better equipped to deal with mental issues and homophobia. After all, God's love is always unconditional. As they say, curiosity kills the cat. Once I also got curious and Google to know if there are any gays in Lucknow. I was 15 at that time. And ooh la la, the search results not only displayed that there are gay men, but also showed where they meet. I couldn't believe. Secretly, I was very happy. The first thought was, wow, I'm not alone. For almost a year, I did not meet anyone. I used to feel guilty and shame, and every morning I prayed for forgiveness. But nights were seen. I was chatting and trying to understand myself better through interactions. I liked one guy and almost after a year of chatting, I decided to meet him. We decided to meet in a cafe. I was very nervous. It was for the first time that I met another gay guy. We chatted a lot about everything. I was so glad. I discussed about issues that were affecting me, and loneliness, our society's attitude and above all, my religion. It was enlightening for me. Next Sunday, he took me to a park. I was both excited and nervous. Excited because I am going to meet other guys and nervous because I was not sure how will I be accepted. But the meeting turned out to be great. I made new friends. I was happy but thoughts about my religion kept disturbing me. does not discriminate between state and gay. He loves everyone equally. As Pope Benedict said, Who am I to judge? And therefore, only God can judge me, not anyone else. Accept yourself. It's beautiful. It's liberating. 
it's okay to be game.